Now entering Nerdist.com. Hello, everybody, and welcome to this week's episode of the Half Hour Happy Hour with Allison and Alex. I'm Allison Hayslip. And I'm Alex Albrecht. Sitting in with us is always the lovely and talented Tom Super Volcano Cry. Wow, I, you like really just skipped a major part of the show. Yeah, but uh, it was worth it. Thank you. Also, I feel like I got to the good you part, like, right, Tom? You were like, yeah. screw talking about what the show is about. Yeah. Nobody cares what the, the show is about. Hot. Turn off the AC, For the about the next 30 are, minutes. Oh, yeah. We're going to be sipping some news and spitting some news. Sure. All right. It's going to yeah. be that type of show, guys. Yeah, we're it's going to be that type of show. How are you guys show. doing? How was your week? You know what I forgot to tell you last week? What? what? <laughs> I pelotoned. What? Yeah. My brother, when I was in New York... My brother got a Peloton. Amazing. What so, did you think? I mean, it's it's <laughs> really hard. Well, well and I just you got to be sure you could do I did it. Right. I did beginners or advanced beginners. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For 30 it's minutes. Good. And I was like, <sighs> yeah. yeah. I was like, stop yelling at me. <laughs> She's like, go, Allison, go. I see you. Well, I didn't do the live classes. I have yet to do a live yeah. class. I just feel like at some point somebody's going to look at the camera and be like, Whatever my username yeah. is, USA, what the fuck's your problem? And I'll be yeah. like, uh, uh, and then I'll be like, whatever your username, USA, dropped, yeah. has left the class. Yeah. <laughs> my I Peloton know. broke. But, but like, it's, it's I, I totally get the appeal of it. Yeah. It's right? great. It's just because it's like, it's like going to a spin class, a spin class, yeah. but you don't have to leave your home. Yeah. 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 I find, <sighs> so last week, bad. Did not do any Peloton. The week before uh, that, did Peloton four days nice. all week. Good, good, good. Yeah. Getting back to it this week. Yeah. I realized for me, the funny thing is, it's about putting on the clothes. Yeah. I think you've said this before. Have I said this before? Yeah, that totally it's about have. putting on the clothes. <laughs> and so you now put them it's on, like, you're like, well, now I have to work yeah, out. Yeah. And it's easy yeah. to put on clothes. Like, yeah. this is not, it's not I've like I'm like ju- jumping into like a whole big thing. Yeah. I'm just like, I'll just put my shorts on. And yeah. then it's like, well, I have my shorts on. Now I'm an asshole if I take my shorts <laughs> off and I haven't done it. Yeah. That, that makes me an asshole. So you just you have to do it where you wake up in the morning and don't put on anything else. No, I can't. The morning is so not so, a good so time. It's not healthy to work out in the morning. Cause you really? Have to, yeah, it's oh, not. Well, thank you for that, Because your body Dr. needs Tom. to warm up throughout the day. You, people have a lot of heart attacks working out in the morning because their body's oh, not ready yet. Yeah. Interesting. So there you go, Alex. I, Wait, I, but I don't you work, work out in the morning? morning. <laughs> no. I thought you'd do like wake up and do your like. Sets. Yeah, if I have to go do work like at a office or something, yeah, I will. Interesting, but you know, whatever. Interesting. <laughs> do you you do workouts in the morning? What, what's yeah, your, like, but workout? I, I, I feel only... like you're always sort of coming from a workout when yeah, I see you. But I mean, my workout <laughs> yeah. is 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 taking like a thirty five forty minute hike. So it's That's not good. like That's I'm doing good. something. Super. I'm not like hopping in on a spin class. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. Know? I started doing so. fifteen minute aerobics workouts at home. Yeah, oh, fun. <laughs> that look horrible. On yeah. YouTube? Yeah. Interesting. 15 minute beginners. I did, I, did uh, I think we talked, I mean, Very I know hard. we talked about back in the day, but I used to do that uh, T25. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, 25 minutes Dude, every day. It's tough. It would fucking, yeah. It well, but look at us. We're all studs. Yeah. Well, uh, I was. We're, we're all studs. At least Allison and I are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fucker. <laughs> this half, this half of yeah. the table. <laughs> but I, I have my own half of the yeah. table. <laughs> if we split it, if we split it oh, this no. way, this is the pizza half. <laughs> the, pizza. <laughs> oh, the pizza half sounds like the fun yeah, half. Yeah, it I don't is. Hang out with the pizza. You and your kale half can go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Mm. Um, what? Speaking of which, Ooh. I went to um, Petty Cash. Huh? You've been to Petty oh yeah, Cash the taco on place, Beverly. It's so good. Holy shit! Yeah, I feel like so. It used to be called Grace, maybe something like that. What? Or it's been Petty Cash. No, I know for a really long time. Yes, yes. So I don't know this what it was before is. that. Yeah. So before that, it was this place that we used to go all the time. Okay. And then that closed, and Petty Cash came in, and we got really excited about it when it first came in, and I opened up like the not yep, well I guess yep, whatever. I saw the menu, and it's like five dollars a single taco. Yeah, it is. And I saw it, and I was like, "Fuck that place!" <laughs> yeah, close. Never went. Yeah, I literally went like three days ago, right? Because somebody was like, "Let's do a happy hour." Oh, they have a really good there. happy hour. It was great. Yeah, fucking kale, cauliflower, nachos, nachos? the best. <laughs> what? They're so good. Okay, do- should not be good. Yeah, no, they're so they're kale vegan cold. nachos, Ugh. and they're insane. Insane. Insanely yeah. good. Wait, are I'll they be vegan the or are they just that. vegetarian? I think they're just vegetarian because they have I, cheese. I think there is cheese yeah, in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's oh, yeah, it's like cauliflower. It's they like flash fry cauliflower and kale. Yeah, and put them all over these chips. And there's like sliced jalapeno. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's just, really good. 
And it's it on was, the happy hour menu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the matcha beef uh, quesadilla. Yeah. <sighs> Uh, so anyway, so now I'm like, that's a place. You're like $5 a taco, fine. Yeah, I'm like, I get why they spend $5 a taco. This is a good taco. The guy yeah. with the Tesla and solar roof. Now I'm hungry. Peloton complains about a $5 taco. Dude, yeah. it's sorry, not about Alex. money. It's not about it's money. Principal. It's principal. It's principal. It's principal. I get it's it. It's principal. <laughs> I just bought a new uh, duvet cover oh, for my bed. Fancy. I know. And I got you it all like. up your yeah, apartment. You're going to have company I, uh, over. I've been so annoyed. Like, I... I <laughs> Yeah, um, so I've I've had the same like bedding for uh, probably five years yeah, now, yeah. and I've had this like greenish duvet cover that matched the place that I lived in when I got it, and then I moved, oh, yeah. and it's still matched in that place, and now I live in my new place, yeah. and it's never gone in my bed. Like I every time I walk works. in, it's it's, it's got yeah exactly. It's, yeah. It was functioning, but it just didn't look right. <laughs> yeah, and it's, it's been bugging me, but for whatever the le- le- reason, the last few months, every time I see it, I'm like, I need to get a new duvet cover. I finally did it this week, but I ordered it, like, got it on some crazy discount, whatever. I was going to say, like, where did you get it? West Elm. Oh, all right. Yeah, but it was, like, on clearance, and it was, like, I was, like, this is perfect. This is exactly what I want. And then I go to check out, and they charge me $14 for shipping, and I'm, like, fuck! I don't know why it's so frustrating. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, I was saving $150 on this duvet cover, getting it the way that I was getting yeah, yeah, it, yeah. and then having to but pay $14 for shipping. shipping. <laughs> I'm, like, God, isn't everything free shipping? That's why you got to go Amazon. Amazon. Well, I would, except I can't get West Elm on Amazon. Well, you could get a West Elmish. Yeah. Nah. nah. Yeah. It's West Elm cheese. Oh, by the way. What? Did I talk to you about the, the paper towels thing? Oh, God. I'm so excited. No. What is the paper towels? <sighs> you ordered paper feel, towels online, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. No, well, no. I order paper towels online all the time. And then you forgot to <laughs> cancel the recurring order, and now you have 700 rolls of paper towels. No, but also that would be amazing, <laughs> and then I would learn how to do paper mache. Oh my god! Because uh, how bad. else? Like, I would just that's be, with newspaper. I don't <laughs> think a paper towel. Is you could probably do. Towel. Really? Yeah, it's just it's just yeah. paper and paste. But it's a different type of paper. <laughs> nah, it's still mache. It's still sure. mache. Don't step on his dreams. Yeah. Sorry. Anyway, long story short, none of that happened. <laughs> what I was really gonna say was, I was in the kitchen and I was doing dishes and my I was like hands wet in yeah. you know like elbow into dishes. Oh no! Did the entire roll of paper towels fall in the water? No, I looked <laughs> over and I was like, "Oh fuck, we're out of goddamn paper towels." And then I was like, "Well, I'll just go get another one from the closet." And right. then I realized, no, that was the last roll of oh, paper no. towels. So then I went, "You don't have rat like dish." Alexa, buy paper towels. <gasps> and she goes, "The last time you bought paper towels was an order of thirty six count, you know, plenty <laughs> right. paper towels." Do you want me to order that again? And I go, yep. And she goes, ordered. Wow. Wow. That and I was like, cool. while you're all right. right. You're like, I'm and the then commercial. I was like, fuck. What else can I that order? Really? That that just makes sense now. Yeah. So then Heather was like, oh hey, will you order? Oh, this is really funny because it's so classically me and Heather. Uh, she goes, will you order toilet paper? And I was like, oh yeah, sure, sure, sure. And then I'd go and do like a thousand other things that day. And then I was like in the kitchen and I was like, oh, right. I'm supposed to order toilet paper. And then I go, Alexa, order toilet paper. Yeah. And she goes, well, the last time you ordered toilet paper was a blah, blah, blah of Charmin Ultra Soft. It was like 826 like, count. Yeah, right. <laughs> and I go, yeah, do that again. And she goes, okay. And then I can't remember what happened. Like two days later, I was like, oh, yeah. I was like, oh. And I used the thing. I did I use the, you know, Alexa what? to yeah. order paper, to order the toilet paper. And she goes, oh, I already ordered toilet paper. Oh, no. And I go, did you think I was going to forget ordering uh, the toilet uh, paper? Uh, and she goes, yeah. yep. Yeah. yeah. And I was like, well, I didn't. So then guess what? What? Toilet paper arrived. Two different orders? No, one order. And I was like, so whose was it? Oh. And, she, and she goes, well, I didn't look. And so I actually went into the <laughs> oh recycling, my gosh. and I looked at the thing, and I was like, mm-hmm. Oh, mm-hmm. it was yours. It was your order? Yeah. Oh. Take that. Uh-huh. Take yeah. that, Alex's wife. Yeah. Gosh, I was like, man. you so asked So did she not get- actually order it? <laughs> no, she did. Hers showed up later. I mean, look, we oh. need toilet paper. It's not like we're going to be like, well, the toilet paper went bad. <laughs> <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't use it within the allotted three and a half weeks <laughs> that toilet paper was good. The toilet paper went bad. Don't rub that on your butt. That toilet paper's bad. <laughs> I assume we just made a bunch of people's Alexas order toilet oh, paper. I know. Paper I'm very towers. excited. Yeah. By the way, but everybody <laughs> needs it. Yeah. Nobody's going to be like, God damn, cancel that. Well, I mean, fuck, we're kind of running yeah. low. Oh I guess I'll, I'll keep. But it really made me realize, like, oh, shit, that's a whole other layer to the Echo that I just have never been using. Right. I mean, we've had uh, Echoes for 
Yeah. I can't even remember. You know, it's four Since years. Since the beginning of like time. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And so it's really crazy because before it was like, oh, ask it a question. And yeah. Turn on the music. What's the weather going to be like? I mean, we do yeah. now have it <clears throat> have it so that um, it turns the lights on every morning and, oh. and at night. Cool. That's neat. So we'll say, Alexa, good night. Alexa, good morning. Yeah. Turn on the lights. Turn on this light. Turn on that light. So that And that's Sweet. really fun. Uh, I mean, fun. It's easy. Yeah. Because <laughs> instead of like going around and turning on the five lights that they are in the living room. It should take you a few hours. God. It, My gosh. <laughs> over the course of a week, it might have yeah. come. It actually might have. Turning on and off all those now. goddamn switches. <laughs> switches for bitches. That's what I say. <laughs> switches for bitches. <laughs> I feel like that should be a t shirt somewhere. Switches yeah. for bitches. It's just a light switch and it just says, yeah. Switches for bitches. <laughs> and on the back it says, Alexa, good night. Oh, I like that. Yeah. What's up? T shirt made. Man, we have so many of those t shirts that we never <laughs> make. So many t shirts. My brother does that thing where he, like, he has like a monthly order of paper towels mm-hmm. and toilet yep. paper and everything, but it arrives in. The largest cardboard box. Oh, yeah, yeah. What a waste when you order I know. something sometimes. Yeah, I'm sometimes like, it's what? like, yeah. yeah. I know. I get real sad when I open something from Amazon and it's clearly like real tiny and then there's like so much packaging around oh, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> but, you know, it's fucking Amazon. They, yeah. they rule the world. Yeah. yeah, they do. Basically. Pretty soon they're going to rule the space. The spaces. Yeah. The spaces. The spaces. All the space. All the space. All the space. 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 Final yeah. frontier. Space. Oh my what was God. that from Command that, and Conquer? Yeah, that Tim Curry. It's my favorite thing. Whenever I'm feeling sad, I just look that up. Spence. Going to the one place that has not been corrupted by capitalism. Spice. Amazing. Uh, Spice. Uh, All right, here we go. You ready for yeah. this first email? Are we, we going got? to an email? Yeah, oh, great. Email, email. Sweet. Who's it from? Mini Cooper Wave. <gasps> hey, guys and gals. Hello, Allison. Hi, who's it from? Uh, Lauren. Hi, Lauren. I'm writing because I myself, for many years, was a lease, lease, lessee Le- of Volkswagens and oh. recently made the switch to a Mini Cooper. Ooh-hoo-hoo. Wanting to ask Allison if she's also noticed when you pass other Minis, the wave. <laughs> oh, I have God. gotten peace signs, head nods, and my favorite, waving frantically like an excited kid <laughs> seeing the same car on the road. Oh. Thanks, I Lauren. I have not thing. noticed. Now that makes me feel like maybe I've just been ignoring a bunch of people yeah. who are waving at me. Or you're well, I'll pay it, attention now. Yeah, you're focusing on the road. Yeah. So well, that's which is probably say, a good thing. Yeah. My mother my mother was one of like, you know, probably forty people who actually drove a PT cruiser. Oh yeah. <laughs> wow. For a while. Yeah. She my had, parents had the convertible she, one. Yeah, she when had they multiple moved to LA. PT cruisers. Wow. And she said that people did that when she would see other PT cruisers, yep. they would all acknowledge each For other. For sure. Yeah. Oh, sure. Yeah. I had that car. So my folks got the PT Cruiser convertible. By the way, I still think we have it. Oh, my gosh. Um, yeah, I know. Because my dad loved it because he was like, oh, my God, it's like an old 50s yeah. car. Like yeah. These are the types of cars that we had, like the old Woodies yeah. back in San Diego. And so they bought one for uh, their place in La Jolla when they bought the place in La Jolla. Right. And so periodically I would just have it up here for some whatever reason. Like yeah. I don't – whatever. Um, and I vividly remember driving – like uh, down sunset with and the top other down PT and cruisers. other PT cruisers, <laughs> but also uh, just people randomly were like, "Fuck, nice car!" You know, really? I mean? Yeah, because they it's Southern California, tops down. It's maybe, like maybe very it's, California car. Maybe it's different on the East Coast. Because on the East Coast, people were like, "Why <laughs> the hell is, is anyone uh, driving a PT cruiser?" Yeah. yeah, I mean, it is a California yeah. car yeah. for totally. sure. Yeah. Like that is it is like Southern California car Man. from the old days. Yeah. Uh, Oh, that was just going to remind me. So I missed this with uh, riding a motorcycle. Oh. So when you ride a motorcycle, you Other always, get the, you always like... get the two fingers down. Oh. It's like this motorcycle wave because yeah. it's your non, it's non-throttle it's hand, mm-hmm. and it's again, it's to the opposite side of traffic. So whenever you see a motorcycle, you, everybody always puts the, the sort of oh. t- two motorcycle fingers. Really? Yeah. Just, to, 100%. just, just, just like, what's hello? up? Yeah. It's just like, hey, Dude. hey. Like, it just oh. always happens. And it's... <laughs> The coolest thing because huh. you feel like you really are part of a club when you ride a motorcycle. Yeah. Like any other motorcycle person's like, "What's up?" You had a motorcycle? Uh, <clears throat> I've had many. You, like, there was one in this garage for many years. Uh, oh, I guess I don't pay attention yeah, to maybe, anything in the show. I was like, you know maybe that. you didn't. I was like, might have been back in the TRS days. No, I've had uh, many, uh, many motorcycles. Yeah, I don't oh, think you've right. had one for a while. No, I yeah. sold the. Yeah. I sold okay, my, I my big. I was in an Uber the other day, and we were stopped at a light, 
and a motorcycle pulled up next to us and my Uber driver rolled down the window and had an entire conversation with the motorcyclist. Oh, funny. And I was like, I'm just the weirdo <laughs> sitting in the back seat. Like, That's amazing. <laughs> what me. were they talking about? The Uber driver was like, is that a Harley? Because it was like blacked out. Yeah, and he's yeah, like, yeah. yeah. He's like, I don't like flashy stuff. So I like blacked it all out. But yeah. I, I don't know, whatever. And then they had motorcycle <laughs> And then you're talk. like, nah, motorcycle, motorcycle, motorcycle. Yeah. And the light went and Yeah, we're basically. Green. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but, I, but that's the thing is when I got the Tesla, I was like, ooh, I'm going to be part of the Tesla the club. The Tesla crew. Yeah. Nope. Nope. I thought you were. You were driving You did. Yeah, you once. said you were like putting no, no, your that, hands up. Yeah, that was the most Tesla crew, Tesla okay. thing that's ever happened with the autopilot. So Tesla. It's but so no, Tesla. the problem Tesla. is. That was Tesla AF. The problem yeah. is there's a lot Tote. of like old people who buy the Teslas and there's a they, lot of like. They, don't really? want to do they just don't uh-huh. care. You know what I mean? Like they're not all like. They're over it. Yeah. Like my buddy totally. Mike has like his license plate says, yay, Elon. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And like that, like those people are like waving at other Teslas. Yeah. yeah. But the majority of the people in Hollywood are like not people who want to be waving at. That's like, true. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah, that's true. Anyway. Yeah. All right. Anyway. No email. Uh, so, by the way, oh? she did a PS in this email. Oh, okay. Oh. But it kind of connects with the next email and story. Okay. So I don't want to spoil that next email and story, right. so I'm going to wait. Okay, got it. But then I'm going to bring swoop okay, back. Okay, L- Lauren, we are going to acknowledge your PS. Yeah, because okay. it sort of makes sense. All right, here we go. All right. Man, you, I like that you like made these connections. <laughs> yeah. Alex does work on the show. Know. He's the only one that does <laughs> like what? work for the show. No, and then I was like, I think I didn't hit the thing. Hold on. There it is. No, no, no. Hold on. No. Suspense here, Alex. This is good. Uh, oh, here it is. Great. Yeah, see, I didn't. I didn't yeah. Anyway. <laughs> okay, who's this from? Well, that's an interesting thing <laughs> as well. <laughs> So well, I'm going to try this and let's okay. see what happens. Okay, We're just going to trust you with this. Yeah. Hi, HHHHH crew, including Tom in parentheses. <laughs> yeah. I'm. Who is it? Wait, wait, wait. Oh. I'm Stuart. Stuart? Stuart? Stuart. 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 From the UK here. Pronounced S T Y U hyphen U R T rather than S T O O hyphen U R T. Oh, he's saying his name, his name is Stuart, but where he's like, you don't say it. We say it right. Stuart. So I was trying to nail the Stuart. pronunciation. Stu- right. Stuart. Stuart. Anyway. Uh, hello, whatever. Stuart. Hi, Allison. Ah, see? <laughs> uh, I've been a big fan since episode one yeah. and before with TRS Indignation. Wow. But I've seen something truly horrifying oh, no. that I need to share with you. Much love Uh-oh. and jumping Uh-oh. spider bites. Uh-oh. Stuart. All right. Stuart. Here we go. You ready for this? Yes. Jumping spider crickets are here to spend summer what? with you. In the UK. Spider oh, crickets? God, the UK. You're like, it's over an ocean away. No, 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 no. But the whole point mean? is... They can jump continents? <laughs> yeah. Spider what? fucking crickets. What? No, these are the crickets that we all had on the East Coast. Oh, so you know those crazy crickets that were like... So, like, most people's crickets aren't those weird... I, I think they were called, like, water bugs or oh, whatever. yeah. Like, those weird crickets yeah. that had, like, six legs and they were sort of spindly. All crickets have six legs. No, 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 no. These crickets. What crickets? That looks like a regular cricket. Yeah, no, those are called jumping cricket. spider crickets. They are? We just think what? that they're regular crickets. Oh, oh, oh. Jesus Christ. Why, because, why spider? Because okay, they okay, have six ahead. legs. Oh, but they're not going to bite me Spiders like a spider. have eight legs. No, but it, because most crickets have just two back legs and two front legs <laughs> no, and wings. No, all oh. crickets have six legs. Allison went to college. She knows this stuff. Yeah. Did, but did she but even go to cricket these, school? Do these bite? Crickets. Is that why they're called? I don't have a degree in cricket. Yeah, she's not cricket a cricketologist. I'm trying to, make, <laughs> trying to support I'm Allison here. at the same time. <laughs> I'm trying to support Allison here. No, these are jumping spider crickets. Okay, but and all crickets, crickets have six legs, and also spiders have eight legs, so that doesn't answer why they're yeah. called jumping See? spider because crickets. Because they look like spiders, no. and they jump like crickets. Okay. That is why they're I technically called jumping spider crickets. I think it's crickets. more like their antenna make it look like they have eight legs. Oh, she's I mean, maybe. That's, that's probably just, a more reasonable a answer. Disgusting looking cricket. That but is. like... So that is not what all crickets look like. That's what all, all <laughs> Hashtag our crickets. Hashtag not all crickets. <laughs> Hashtag not all crickets. <laughs> but that's that's what all our crickets look okay, got like it. on the East Coast. Got uh, it. Which were fucking creepy as shit. Yeah. Okay. I remember being, and they jump weird. They're like, Ugh, yeah, fuck. Okay. Yeah. Like my friend had them all over his basement. And I was like, I'm not going <laughs> down there, man. Fuck no. that shit. But 
Okay. They've now migrated from the U.S., where they are ha, predominant, ha, to the ha. U.K. You can have our crickets, <laughs> but you'll never take our freedom. <laughs> what? Yeah, we took it back. <laughs> We're like, we'll take our freedom back. Uh, you can keep tea. Nobody really cares yeah. about that here. Uh, and here's some jumping spider crickets. Speaking of, I've been listening to so much Hamilton lately. Oh, really? And that, yeah, and like when you listen to it over and over again, you kind of go like, Man, we it's kind of fucked up how we got our country. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like when you when you like really I mean I, clearly totally. Hamilton is a, a it's a exaggerated exaggerated. Yeah. Yes, exactly. But still I'm like wait, that happened and that yep. happened and oh man. Yeah. Yep. Anyway. Yep. Hi, yep. We hi, were horrible highly people. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're very horrible. But now here we go back to coincidentally in Laura's email. Okay. Oh yeah, the PS. P.S. If y'all are brave enough, oh, do no. a g- Google search for spider crickets. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Living in New Jersey on a first floor apartment, the beginning of summer, my laundry yeah, room Jersey. got overrun with these things. Oh, God. That's gross. I hear Allison screaming gross. no in the background. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So the jumping so the jumping cricket spiders. Jumping, jumping spider, spider crickets. crickets. So, like, those are... Ba- like out here, we don't have those jumping spider crickets. Not those weird, funky. No, we have little. Ones. Yeah, we have little ones. They're like little ones. Yeah, right. But yeah. on the East Coast, Which fucking creepy, giant, weird yeah. fucking crickets that I fucking hate. Like yeah. scare me as a child. Crickets. <laughs> uh, now they've migrated to the UK. Ha! How the hell do they get to the I UK? Have no Take that. idea. Do they stow away? Probably. Like, yeah. Probably on ships orders? or something like yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know. That's because the other thing. That's the other thing about listening to Hamilton is uh, Angelica Schuyler, who is the sister to Hamilton's wife. Um, she she marries someone and moves to London, but in a few years comes back to the states like two or three times. And I'm like, Jesus! Back then it was like yeah. a two and a half week boat. <laughs> yeah, like ride. what like, are you doing? Like once you get over there, I feel like you stay. You yeah. know? Yep. It's not like <laughs> hopping on a plane and being like, "Hey, I'll be in Philly in six hours or whatever." Well, and by the way, once they get the fucking supersonic shit worked out, come yeah. on, let's get on that. Yeah, please. Let's do it, man. Three hours to London, <laughs> that would be nice. Oh my God, that'd be so nice. Wouldn't that be great? I would go so much more. Oh, yeah. Pff, I yeah. already go so much. I would go so much more. Yeah, I yeah. would go. I would go once, which would be so much more. Yeah, oh, see? Never, I go zero. <laughs> you've never been to London? Have you been to Europe been at all? Italy and oh, France. Oh, Italy, okay. Yeah. Layover. yeah. Oh Italy my gosh! Nice, but no, no, I'd love to go to. But Tom, you you are I, like, yeah, like Ain't Tom's us. basically British without the accent. Yeah. I feel yeah. like I do. Look you know? like a little. You do. Like ruffian. Like, yeah, and just sitting at a like pub, a British and, bruiser, and drinking pints. <clears throat> yeah. Until yeah. twelve right. midnight when Boy, everything mate. closes. Yeah. I'll bash you in the face. <laughs> yes. Is that Australian? Yeah. And also really of. horrible. Yeah, it was oh. sort of a mix of both. And oh. then I, by the way, you, Get I would just love too. you being drunk at a uh, at an actual <laughs> British pub and just saying all oh, those yeah. things. Get oh, in yeah. And they're like, oh. this fucking guy. Yeah. <laughs> that Australian's my favorite new person. Stewart. <laughs> <laughs> that Australian Tom is my favorite new Australian. person. Australian. Thanks, Paul McCartney. <laughs> yeah. Right. yeah. Is that the only way you can do a British accent is if you imitate Paul McCartney? No, but I like it because that's sort of like not – because you know he's going to be in like like <laughs> Wales or like someplace not – he's not going to be in London proper. He's going to be outside in Bristol. Yeah. Jen says all my impressions and my accents are horrible. Yeah. That hurts my feelings because no, I try they're, hard. They're, they're great in a horrible way. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Ian. Yeah, like they're like super you've, fun. You've achieved like maximum horribleness. Horribleness? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Got, so I that's see. something I to be impressed somewhere. by. It's like you're like Willem Dafoe. You're so <laughs> ugly that you've turned around to handsome again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're so yeah. ugly you've turned around to handsome? <laughs> yeah. There's some people that are like <laughs> really <laughs> like – like uh, uh, who are just like, wow, you're so – like. Technically oh, not attractive, but there's something's very attractive. Yeah. Like Willem Dafoe is a good looking dude, <laughs> but then when you look at him, you're like, no, he's not. Like you're right, but like, he is handsome. But right. he's not a good look. Like his face is not tradi- He's not yeah. like if you look at Willem Dafoe and like Henry Cavill. Yeah, it's like Henry Cavill, handsome man. Willem Dafoe, not handsome man. Right. But then you're like, no, Willem Dafoe just as handsome as Henry Cavill, but well, just in a weird uh, way. I think it's less handsome and more that. There's like there's like an appeal about him. Like yeah. it's like his it's, like who he is essence. is like yeah. you're like that's an attraction, you know. Yeah. Yeah. See? Interesting. Yeah. That worked for me. Yeah. There don't have the looks, but I got that attraction, I think. There you go. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm just saying I love the I'm saying that right now. I got that attraction, I think. <laughs> I think. Did I? I think. I don't know. Do I? Do I? Could I not have gotten I do. my wife with these looks. Yeah. This is true. 
What do you mean with those I, looks? I had to get her. You're adorable, Tom. <laughs> oh, thank you. I just you're, wanted you to say you're, you're an adorable. adorable British. British. I was fishing with for your, compliments. With your huge arms. <laughs> thank you. Oh, you noticed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These t-shirts from 1985, from when <laughs> I was eight. <laughs> Uh, shirt. Ooh, speaking of a shirt from 1985. Okay. So I heard this on the radio the other day, and I was like, Ooh. that is really interesting. There's a new um, dating group. Like group? A, yeah. Like so not it's an like, app. Like a... Not an app, but it's like a get-together. like a, okay. Almost yeah. like you know speed dating, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Speed dating's yeah, yeah, yeah. not an app. It's sort of like a group, I guess yeah. you would say. A method. Method, thank you. Dating I like method. it. Dating yeah. method. Uh, <clears throat> so it uses your sense of smell. What? What? Yeah, it's called like pheromone dating no. or something wow. like that. Wow, okay. I mean, because so that's a huge part do, of date, like of, yep. a, of attraction. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So what you do is each participant buys a new shirt mm. and then oh. sleeps in that shirt for four days, no four, way. four nights. Wow. Just sleeps in it for four nights and then puts it in the plastic bag and brings it to this pheromone party. What pheromone party? <laughs> and then what happens is all the guys have their pheromone like <laughs> the girls go and smell all of the guys shirts oh and then choose which ones of them that they were really? like ooh that I, oh that Get I like that out of here. smell and the guys do the same thing and then if there are matches you Get? then go and do like these little like 10 what? minute dates wow okay that's Isn't that crazy awesome i know i kind of want it i mean just I to mean, try it yeah, like just because like, the weirdest. Need... there's something kind of cool about that because i do feel like there's this weird um like the the hurdle in dating is enjoying your time with a human being, but then also being attracted to them. Yeah. Because a lot of times, like with the apps and things, you can have great conversations like via the app and right. whatever, and then you meet up in person. You're just like, oh, nah. it's not there. Yeah. Or you, know? you may flip by somebody's photo that you're yeah. actually very attracted to. You just don't. But the photo the fo- doesn't. Or you, or yeah. or the 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 first look of the person isn't what it is. It's the whole. Yeah. Conversation smell. I mean, like all of yeah. that is really intense. Yeah. You know what I mean? If like, I were to sleep in a shirt for four days, though, I, that's the I don't. That's know. what I was I mean, thinking. I, I was like, so my shitty smell. Like, I maybe yeah. like sleep on nice a shirt. Sweats. I sleep yeah, on, sleep on, on it. it. Yeah, just like put it on my pillow and just be like, it so smells funny. like me. <laughs> yeah. But then I was like, like my shirt. Like, uh, I wouldn't say that I have like that. My smell uh, yeah. is your scent. <laughs> Well, but like a lot of people your are like, musk. oh, you smell good. What What is you, you're wearing? And it's right. usually Hairstyle. my deodorant. Oh. oh, right. And I'm like, or my moisturizer. Uh, yeah. 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 So it's like uh, between the like patchouli moisturizer <laughs> yeah. and the like axe, yeah. even though it's nice, <laughs> or Old axe Spice. Deodorant? Uh, it's not the douchey axe. What? It's like, but, like, are you 25? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, it's so. <laughs> the, here, this, this is the short version of the story. So I use Old Spice. I okay. used to use Old Spice because it just was the best at nice. keeping my. Thank you. Very nice. It was just the best at keeping my pits dry. Okay. And I sweat a lot. Yeah. Like I. You and me both, man. But I, I, for me, it's like, it could be cold as ice. Especially if I'm like hosting. Cold as ice. Oh, yeah. No. Like if I'm hosting, my pits just go. Yeah, I'm the same way. (laughs) Moist. (laughs) Bam. Like that. That's why I wear tank tops most of the time. Yeah. That's interesting. I like that. Uh, But so for me, I have to wear like uh, sweat pads. Yeah. In my arms when I'm doing like hosting, like technical (laughs) hosting. Yeah. For like BlizzCon, they'll put like sweat pads in. Yeah. Yeah, Um, but anyway, so I always sort of think about like, oh god, my. So it's like I always wear black shirts and stuff yeah. like that because I'm like, you can't see the sweat as much, right? So I was talking to f- friend of the show Jerry Trainer, yeah, Jerry, and we were lamenting this, and or I, we just I don't know how we got on the topic. We were playing video games, and somehow pit sweat came up. <laughs> uh, but he was like, I actually, he was like, I found. He was like, I'm going to tell you my favorite. Like the best deodorant at stopping that I have found is Axe, and, and he goes, and don't don't you know don't make fun <laughs> because I actually found a scent that isn't offensively Axe, so it's this like Axe stuff, and he basically just like sent me an Amazon link of like this is what I get, and so I just ordered it to try it, yeah, and so that's what I've been, but so like. What's the my scent? My shirt is going to smell like my axe and patchouli. Like it's right. not going to smell like me. Right. So how, so is the pheromone thing just like, you know what I mean? Wait, yeah, what totally what what's it. the accent? I don't I don't even, Oh, the, the accent? accent. It's on yeah. the end of the sentence. <laughs> oh, stop it's it. The accent. <laughs> stop it. I don't know. How do you not know? Nice? Oh, come good. on. No, actually, it's axe. It's going to be like No, it smells like dryer sheets. <laughs> it's gonna, it's, no, I mean it smells like dryer sheets. Oh. But you're also supposed to sweat. It's like healthy to sweat. Right. You clog those pores. Well, I mean, look, at the end of the day, it's like you can clog pores and then you, you sweat will come somewhere. That's you know true. what I mean? 
Although, my God, setting up fucking <laughs> Heather's show last night, I just, I don't know what it is, but it's like doing work, yeah. it's in the sun, yeah. and it's just like Dude. dripping. What do you mean you Dude. don't know what it is? It's exactly doing work yeah. in the sun. No, but like I've <laughs> done work. No, but there's something about <laughs> this specific thing. Like I've yeah. done stuff in the sun, but I never get like dripping you know, right. with sweat. Now that you started dripping, now that you started doing Peloton, it's probably getting your like. Oh yeah. That when more you work out, the more you sweat when you're not working out. Right. Have you noticed that you're you're sweating more when you're not working out? Your body's your body's churning more. You should stop working out. No, I agree, Tom. (laughs) Thanks, Tom. No. Thanks for giving me that. That's not the answer. Uh, All right. Well, speaking of pheromones. Oh gosh. Is this a segue? This is a segue. Okay. This is kind of disgusting. Yeah. Oh. And the more I read into the article, the sort of more disgusting it got. Oh, Jesus. Because it starts pretty disgusting. I also Uh. feel like you already saying something disgusting means that this is going to be like really disgusting. Yeah, because you're pretty, uh, you know. Hey, 4-H crew. Oh, email. And it goes into a story. Who's this from? Uh, This is from Jason. Hi, Jason. Hello, Allison. I hope that's exactly what Jason's voice sounds like. (laughs) Hello, Allison. It's Air Force Jason. Oh, Air I Force sent you guys Jason. the praying mantis eating birds article early oh, in right. the episode. Yeah. I came across this article and thought you guys would be intrigued and yet a little disgusted at the same oh, time. Boy. <laughs> P.S. I just tw- finished 20 years in the Air Force. Yay! Yeah! Thank you for your service, sir. And finally, at last, I'm free. Thanks for all the laughs to help me and keep my sanity when I was working crazy long overnights. Ooh. Looking forward to hearing new episodes. Cheers, Jason. Nice. Yeah, Jason. Thank you, Jason. Oh no! What's gonna uh, happen? Yeah. You're so what overselling is this about? it now. Yes, yes. Vagina beer oh. is a thing, oh. and it's made from the essence <laughs> of hot underwear models. <laughs> hey! By the way, Can it get you drunk though. That's where it started. <laughs> it gets more disgusting <laughs> as it goes. Wait! I immediately was thinking. Oh, a God. Polish brewery, oh, brewery realized oh, God. their dream of making beer oh. from the essence of women. Wait, this is oh, it's I mean, not. I love women at just all. Just please but... tell me it's not like the yeast. Just tell me it's it's it the yeast. Oh God! Oh. It is. It is. It is a. Uh, oh God! Where? Let me find it. It is vaginal lactic acid of attractive underwear models. Oh, they're attractive. <laughs> they're attractive. That's I'm good. I'm trying so hard not to vomit. <laughs> <laughs> so they take swabs from no! the models. Swabs! And then isolate yeah. lactic acid bacteria <laughs> from their vaginas <sighs> and then <sighs> use that in the fermentation process of the beer. <laughs> Listen, I can understand using it for starter yeast for maybe your sourdough bread. Uh, but beer? Sourdough bread! <laughs> And then this is stuff that the website of the brewery is, like, super into it. It was like, without any modesty, the brewery's website has plenty to say about their beer's potential to customer. This is from the website. This Polish beer. Oh, my God. Imagine a woman of your dreams, your object of desire, her charm, her sensuality, her passion. Now you can try how she tastes. Oh, God. (laughs) Wow. Oh uh, I'm really scared someone's going to send us that for Drunk Smith. No. Yeah. yeah. First off, there, I think that's... it's illegal in the United States. Thank God. I'm just saying oh, that. Yeah. I'm just saying that for our listeners so they know. Oh, Plus, God. it's in Poland. Hopefully, we don't have yeah, any Yeah, how could that be? <laughs> Isn't that like Less listeners some like, weird yeah. form of cannibalism? Yeah. So, again, they – so so this is yeah. – wait, hold on. Where's the thing it's where they say they isolate the Yeah, because the like, there's like not anything else that we're allowed to make from Okay, here we go. For those that are curious just how you go about – about making vagina beer. I don't know. Uh, Paulina <laughs> and Monica were the two models used to produce the beer, and it is from them that these smears came from. Oh. The lactate, lactic acid bacteria from their vaginas oh my God. were then isolated in a lab in order to produce a beer and prevent any, quote, Potentially unsavory elements. Oh, oh yeah, my just gosh. in case there are unsavory elements in their vagina. The- <laughs> Isn't this crazy? Oh my god! Like right, like the the, head- <laughs> I, I the really... headline is disgusting, but then when you do a deep dive, it gets worse. I didn't. I don't feel okay. <laughs> no, you look pretty. Re- you look yeah. white faced now. <laughs> like, like... Well, as long as they're not making oh, god, like Jesus. lactic acid 
egg scrambles for the morning. <laughs> That's the only way it would be worse for you. Oh, my God. Yeah, right. But I just can't even imagine, like... What is wrong with people? Right. Yeah. And then, like... Yeah. Are we that bored? Yeah. We're and, like... Yeah. Like how, and first off, guys are kind of fucking weird. Yeah. Like, there's no girl in the world that's going to be like, oh, did somebody jizz in that beer? Let's do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, like... A guy would be like, so you're saying oh that God. there's the essence of an underwear model in my beer. Oh, yeah. I will try that beer. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, Jesus. Are I'm not disgusting. that desperate. Oh, oh God. I mean, I just really? don't. I mean, yeah. The other thing is, is, like, it's not like that's appealing just in general. Like, you know what I mean? No. Like, right. That's like, oh, why would I want that in my beer anyway? Right. Let like, alone, I, I don't care how I... attractive the girl is. Right. Yeah. I mean, like, I understand that men are attracted to how women taste down there. That's fine. But normally it's tied in with the fact that they're down there. Yes. Right? Yes. I would say that if all of a sudden there was gum that tasted like that, yeah. I wouldn't be like, you know what? I'm going to go get some vag yeah, gum. Like, like, <laughs> the vag, vag gum. Because I really just want that taste. Yeah, yeah you're right. It's I like mean. it's all part like, and parcel with yeah, the experience. Yeah, exactly. It's like- and by the way, the experience is sort of... You know, you better fun. say fucking magical. No, magical uh, yeah. because because of the flavor is something that you don't get outside yes, in the world. Exactly, exactly. You know, if you're chewing gum, you're drinking beer. You're like, ah, I guess it's the same. Right, shit. right, right, right. No, it's like it's this magical. Yeah, it's thing. more. It's more than just the taste. Yeah, it's all the other senses combined. Uh, I think. God, all of this is uncomfortable. Oh God, <laughs> most mostly Dear because of the beer. Sweet Jesus. Most. Mostly because, mostly because of, the, of yes. the beer. All right, I feel like that's a good. <laughs> yeah, note to end I don't on. feel like we can go anywhere else. <laughs> I feel like I need to take a nap. Yeah. I was like, I think I, I broke like, Allison. Yeah. Actually, Jason broke Allison. Jesus Christ. <sighs> All right. Well, if you liked what you heard today, <laughs> you can email us at halfhourhappyhourfans at gmail.com. Follow us on Twitter at halfhourhappyhr. Please subscribe to us on whatever you listen to us on iTunes, Stitcher, Google Play, Spotify. Snap. Snap. That's that. a thing? No. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> uh, and share us with your friends, please. Yeah. It tends to work out. Yeah. People right. actually like us. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Woo. And that is it for this week's episode of the Half Hour Happy Hour with Allison and Alex. I'm Allison Hayslip. And I'm Alex Albrecht. Sitting in with us as always, the lovely and talented <laughs> Tom. <laughs> I'm so yeah. okay. Super Volcano Gramsci. Bye. <sighs>